and George doesn't seem to have the finesse for such a task. Well, perhaps he's lacking the skill. How long have I been drawing? I mean, I've always enjoyed it, but over the last, let's say, seven years, I've been trying to improve. Look what you got. Huh? Is that a butt? What's between the butt cheeks? What's happening there? Is that a bun? Is that... Who are you? Oh, it's a tail. Oh, okay. Okay. All fine. A panda butt with pants. Right. As as it should be. <laughs> Lacking those legs. Those legs are just oof. Next level. George's trees. Yeah, George is the guardian. The tree guardian. Well, Donald Duck clearly is on a different level of life. <laughs> he has his priorities straight. You think he's a crane. A teamwork makes the dream work, right? Well, no matter what George is, he's clearly doing something. And we will support him, no matter what. Not enough cloth to make pants and a tiny hat. He had to choose. Well, I feel like instead of a tiny hat, he could have made like a a loin cloth, <laughs> loin groin cloth. <laughs> Ooh. You should go and buy some boots. Okay, I mean, feel free if you need some boots. Bye bye, Eric. See you in November. Yeah, I'll be here. Waiting for you to return. Bye-bye, Lynn. Bye-bye. Thanks for being here.
Thus, you think the tree was inside the monster, yeah. Well, you're not the first one, and I can see why that could be assumed, but um, the tree is just gonna be in front of the monster. I didn't want to paint the entire tree, because then I would have to tediously paint around the tree trunk, and I just couldn't be bothered. looks scary. Well, thank you. No, you're not the first one. Maybe George can't be seen by Steve. He just made a sound and Steve is surprised. <laughs> you know, from all the options that are out there, I feel like that is the freakiest. Right, pal. Or maybe Steve was just very much busy chopping wood. You know, that's a pretty loud ordeal. So, a spider, spidery George can quite quietly go over the, the snowy landscape. Yeah, he's he's a delicate boy. <laughs> Meisenberg, hello, welcome. 